The woman without discretion, even the most beautiful woman without discretion, is like a gold ring in a pig's snout. And, and young guys, listen to me. Do not... If you are led into marriage because of the sensuality of the girl, you will hate yourself in the end. You will hate yourself. But if you're led into it by her virtue, her intelligence, her godliness, you will find a mate for life. Young men, we live in a world, even in the professing Christian world, that tells you to chase beauty. And the Bible says, treat it as a common thing. Treat it as unsubstantial. Treat it as an empty thing because it's empty. If you chase beauty, if you make that I'll tell you, many, many young men have lived to regret the decisions they've made. You don't realize, if you're not married, you do not realize what it is to get a bad wife or what it is to get a good wife. And if you chase beauty and you end up getting beauty and you get a godless woman inside that beauty, even if she's a true Christian, but she's contentious, she's unsanctified, she's proud, she's unsubmissive, you're going to live to regret it. Young men, I, I know some of you aren't hearing me. I know you're not hearing me. Because there's such a natural tendency to be drawn towards what is beautiful. But the Bible says, treat it as an empty thing. Treat it as empty. If you are led into marriage because of the sensuality of the girl, you will hate yourself in the end. You will hate yourself.